you ready? We're going to start now, okay? Men, are you there? We're going to do English uh, yes. eight now. And we're going what? to do unit eight and nine. Unit eight and nine, we're going to do speaking and projects. Hey. Uh, yeah. I'll go up. This is unit nine. If you go up to unit eight. Unit eight and nine speaking. Let's go up to eight. Okay, let's go down. And here's speaking. Working pairs, talk about the things you like most about Scotland. Okay, now let's read uh, Scotland first and then we'll talk about it. So let's read this piece here that talks about Scotland yeah. here. Scotland. Scotland is in the north of Great Britain. It's a famous for its regulator as well as its amazing natural beauty. This tour to this land can spell spend and day exploring its historic centuries old castles, but be as, as well as say that some of them are hunted by ghosts, but lovers can expense experience to what world famous famous festival. The Highland game where they are they can enjoy unique Scottish activities such as the being drumming and dancing. They can also see traditional sports or during whiskey with the lo lo local people to driving through fast green. Uh, um, Uh, are putting on sesame legs or logs are other attraction that Scotland offers the great people of this legendary lands have also given many of the more important inventions like the telephone, the television, specimens, and the raincoat. Uh, the capital was the first city in the world to have its own fireplace in uh, 1922. Uh, Indianspruch University welcome to the first film famous medical student in Great Britain in uh, 1869. Okay, good. Okay, now, what do you like about Scotland? What do you think you like about Scotland? Uh, is so now remember, day. there's lots that you can see here. You can see um, the historic castles. You can see the um, the games, the famous games in the the festival games, a uh, dancing, piping, drumming. You can see the scenic lakes where you can go on boats for boat rides.
What do you like about Scotland? Here it said, what do you like about Scotland? I like the castles. Why? Because I want to see a ghost. Okay, what would you like about Scotland? Man? I can't hear you, man. You have to unmute. I like the lights because I can put things in there. Say again, I can't hear. Uh, I like the lake because I can uh, I can put things in the lake. You go what in the lake? What do you do in the lake? Putting. Putting. What's putting? Voting. 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 Okay. So, what is your sentence? You can say, What do you like about Scotland? I like the scenic lake because I can go boating there. I also I would also like to visit some historic castle. I find them very interesting. Okay, can you say that again? Uh, I like second is like because I can go. Watching there, I would also like to visit some historic castle. I find them very interesting. Good. Okay, let's discuss Australia. Let's read about Australia. Yeah, okay, let's read there. Uh, was a country which covers an entire continent, whose capital of sport are uh, outdoor activities uh, seven, 700 of the population regularly uh, participate, whose was longest fence of 5,400 kilometers views to protect what was largest population of six about 175 million claim to seen for outer space. Was largest cattle stations and agri stations larger than Belgium. Belgium, okay. So why would you like why would you like to go to Australia? Because I can see there's a uh, lag was a uh, see the was longest fence uh was large population of six and was large association. What's your last sentence? What's your last sentence, Vidi? Say again. As I like Australia because uh, was Australia half was longest fence, was largest castle stations, and was largest population of sheep.
Hmm, that's an interesting thing to see from outer space. Okay, good. Okay, let's have a look here. Um, that's listening. Project. Okay, here we have Washington, D.C., Washington, uh, Wellington, New Zealand, Ottawa, Canada, and Canberra, Australia. These capital cities are great attractions, working groups of four or five. Do some research, research about one of the cities, then make a list of the places and activities that you think will attract visitors. Design a poster for the city with pictures, present your post to the class, the class work to the post. Okay, choose a city. Then we must find information about the city. Make a list of places and activities that you can see in that city. Would you like to uh, talk about Canberra or Ottawa, Washington or Wellington? Which one do you want to talk about? I can't hear you, sweetie. Which city do you want to choose? Uh, it's uh, Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C. What do you know about Washington, D.C.? Uh, Washington, D.C. Washington. Washington. What do you know about Washington, D.C.? Where is it? In the, uh, in the America. In America, yes. And what can you do there? Uh, it's a... Uh, Area of one hundred seventy kilometers. Uh, and, and the six lakhs in the United States uh, after Houghton's and Ice of Miami. Um, This, but yeah, but now I hear what you're to... saying. Your words doesn't make I can't I can't make out what you are saying. You have to speak slowly and clearly, okay? Tell me again. What do you know about Washington DC? Why would you like to go there? Washington DC has uh 177 kilometers uh in Washington DC is a uh, What do you want to do six here? In okay, but don't tell me about all the ge geography stuff. You need to tell me, look carefully. You have to say what places you can visit there and activities you can do there. That's what you have to tell me. What activities can you do there? Mm, uh, I can check in the uh, kings. I take I check a photos in which uh, Washington DC is uh... okay so you are choosing Washington DC in America okay 
from the steps of the Lincoln Lincoln Mem Memorial to the foot hills of the Blue Ridge Mountains, uh, the Washington DC area has a destination as a destination for every traveler. Enjoy a picnic on the National Mall or a ball game at the National Park. Visit award winning wineries or breathtaking waterfalls. You can experience it all. You can also, um, furthermore, you can stroll from the National Mall to the Tidal Basin to admire the cherry blossoms in bloom. Enjoy upscale shopping in Georgetown or performances and sporting events in China and the Navy Yard. Take in the diverse local culture in distinctly DC neighborhoods like Adams, Morgan, DuPont, Circle, and the U street corridor. Corridor. Okay, so there's a little bit for you that you can say from Washington DC, from the steps of the Lincoln Memorial to the foothills of the Blue Ridge Mountain, the Washington DC area as a destination for every traveler. Enjoy a picnic on the National Mall or a ball game at the National Park. Visit award-winning wineries or breathtaking waterfalls. You can experience it all. Furthermore, furthermore, you can stroll. Stroll means walk from the National Mall to the Tidal Basin to admire the cherry blossoms in bloom. Cherry blossoms are flowers. Enjoy upscale shopping in Georgetown or performances and sporting events in Chinatown and the Navy Yard. Take in the diverse local culture in distinctly distinctly DC neighborhoods like Adams Morgan, DuPont Circle and the U Street Corridor. Yeah, that's what you can say there. So it says there, do research about a city, any city you can choose, Canada, DC, New Zealand, or Australia. Then make a list of the places and activities that you think will attract visitors to the city. Here you have, we have named lots of places, the Lincoln Memorial, the Blue Ridge Mountain, the National Mall, the National Park, Chinatown, and the neighborhoods like the Adams Morgan. Design a poster, present the poster and get the votes from the class. Okay, let's see if you can read it for me. I can't hear you, ma'am. Uh, you can repeat the questions. Read here, sweetie. 
from the Washington DC Americas from the staff of Lincoln's memories uh, and we in the first hill of the blues right mountain the Washington DC area is a is uh you can see has all this question for every travels uh enjoy the picnic our national meals or the program at the national parks this is our winning winners of breathtaking waterfalls you can explain is uh uh, but the more you can cross from the nation's snow mill to the tidal basin to us my the cherries blossom blossom in bloom enjoy enjoy scale shopping in the town of performance and sporting event in china town and the navy town Check the TV local character of Disney's DC. Labels like Arthur Morgan, Super Psycho, and the Ustress Culto. Okay, let's read one more time from the steps. From the steps, the of the Lincoln's memorial to the first hills of the Blue Rice Mountain, the Washington DC area has a destination for every travel. In the picnic on the national mill or program at the national parks, which is awards winning winners uh, of breaking breathtaking waterfalls you can experience is are uh furthermore you can enjoy from the national mill to the tiger spacing to admire the cherry fruit and uh, it blooms. Enjoy up guests uh, shopping in their roles of performance and sporting events to Intina towns and the Navi town. Take uh, is take is the divine locus to in the disease. Uh, Naples like Ata Morgan to form circles and it's corridor. Okay, so that is what you can say about um, about America there, okay? So let's, let's say that for you. Okay, from the four cities, where would you like to go to? Washington, New Zealand. I like to Washington. Where would you like to go to? Yes, uh, I like to Washington DC. Uh, Spiri, what is it? What is there in the background? There's a lot of noise in the background. I can't hear you. Uh, There's lots of noise in your background, okay? Okay, try again. Okay, tell me about America. Why would you like to go to America? I, I can remember. No, no, not not what I typed. I just wanted to speak. Tell me, what do you think about America? Why would you like to go to America one day? Us. Uh, uh, I like. I think there's lots of noise. I don't. I can't hear you. You can't learn like this. You need to let the noise calm down. Tell you, there's lots of noise. Okay, tell me about America. Uh, America's 
Yes, in the states of America is a third largest country in the world and the last third largest in the world uh, is Kansas 50 states. Uh, people often divide the state into four major regions, the north side, the south, the mid West and the West. Uh, the capital of the United States is Washington, D.C., uh, located in the middle of North America. Uh, the uh, type of city is the main symbol of the United States, located in British uh, Island at the port of New York. This is the classical uh, of great size focus on the great islands in the New York Harbors. This status is a symbol of the idea of freedom as well as of the United States itself. Okay, good. Okay, let's have a look at some communication. So they're speaking. Okay, here speaking. Let's read here. Now I want you to read up here for me. We're going to talk about this. Here, you can read there for me. Um, A Toronto is a small town of mist out at night and in this day people set, set the sky darkness very clear the wind was so strong that trees cars and events houses were picked up of carriers for the rest as locals uh as locals uh TV and radio stations in Israel and Ali, warming monster, besides, beside, beside, had had time to text the underground on his payments to powers whose equipment strokes of not. In the band for pay for PM last Monday, although the band have most advanced warming system, there has been no early warming for this one. People were not prepared. Certainly, the roof started moving. The shocking continued to few minutes, it became stronger. People began running away from building as. Was status of college. Miles, the first is Indonesia, are uh, upper again to the go. From the wagon rings, they can see a big clouds as coming from the top of the mountains at the lava random to volcano size. This destroy everything in the past. By next morning, several weeks around Miles, Sinopus, where previous in as Okay, we're going to talk about them here. Working pairs, each pair can choose one of the reports and we role play. So here we can role play. Did you watch the news last night? No, I didn't. What happened? There was a powerful earthquake on Monday. That's shocking. Where was it? 
Now we can choose any of these and talk about it. Let's talk about number A, okay? Okay, now you can ask me the first question. Did you? Uh, this was the news last night. No, uh, I didn't. Uh, what happened? There are a powerful earthquakes on Monday. That's shocking. Where was it? Uh, it's a powerful earthquake. Just is now is of the band for 4 p.m. last Monday. Although the band have a most of a just warming system, there has been too early warming for this one before we're not purpose. Suddenly the graph status moving uh status moving uh, they are shaking continue to a uh, few minutes and became stronger. People began running away from building as war started from collapse. Okay, now let's talk about, uh, did you watch the news last night? Uh, did you watch the news last night? I didn't. What happened? There was a tornado uh, that's shocking where was it it was in missouri and happened at 9 a.m yesterday people said the sky darkened very quickly the wind was so strong that the trees cars and even houses were picked up and carried for miles as local tv and radio station had issued at early warnings the residents had time to take shelter under ground or in basements. Okay, let's talk about the next one. Oh. Did you? Just the what news last night. <laughs> No, I didn't. What happened? Yeah, I just power uh hours. The a volcano erupted in Indonesia. Volcanoes erupted in Indonesia. Okay, tell me more. Two miles in the press, Indonesia erupts again two days ago. Uh, two days ago, from where we were standing, we could see a big cloud of ash coming from the top of the mountain as the lava ran to drain down the volcano sites. It destroyed everything in this past. By the next morning, several villages around Miles Singapore, where business is as and the best. Okay, good. Let's see if there's a project. Okay. A helping hand. Um, there are activities aiming to provide aid for victims of natural disasters. Write a phrase to describe each picture. There, they, these are activities aiming to provide aid for victims of Okay. What do you think happens in picture number one? Oh. 
What happens in picture number one, men? What are they doing there? It's going to really, it's difficult pictures to see what they're doing. I don't know, is that food that they're taking? Is it bags of sand that they're taking to stop the water? I'm not sure what they're taking, can't see it. It's difficult if they don't describe it to us. If they can just give us one name of what they are doing, then we can write a, a phrase or describe each picture. Number two, there's water. I don't know what they're doing there. Three, they're saving someone from buildings, to lap buildings. Four, that's a flood. Five, they're fixing the roof. They're helping people get out. Okay, what do you think happens in picture number one? We'll just have to guess here. Picture one is they push the pack. Push pack. I can't hear, sweetie. Picture one is they push the pack. The bags? What are they doing with the bags? Uh, uh, I don't know. Now you have to try, sweetie. It's, I don't know either. We have to guess here. I don't know what they're doing there. Let's see. Maybe they tell us. Uh, oh, here. Okay. Here it is. Here. Oh, they're providing food or supplies. They are providing food or medical supplies to people. Okay, what's number one? Uh, they are proving food or medical supply. supplies. Number two, what do you think they're doing there? Two is all. They are clearing up. What are they clearing up? Clearing up. Depress. Depress is scattered pieces of rubbish. It's scattered pieces of rubbish um, or remains. Scattered pieces. Okay, number three. Uh, number three is there is helping the people's They are freeing trapped people. People that are trapped from falling or collapsing buildings. Number four. Number four is setting up temporary. Temporarily accommodation. Accommodation for victims. Number five. Uh, number five is the repairing this old um, house. They're repairing houses or buildings. Number six. Six. What's number six? What's number six, sweetie? Six is thing of village or town. Evacuating. What does evacuating mean? Evacuating. What does evacuating mean? Uh, 
to 18 is um, What is evacuating me? So eighteen. You know the word evacuating? No. Evacuating means to take people out of the town and to take them to a safe place. Okay, what does evacuating mean? Um... What does evacuating mean, sweetie? Um, I don't know. I just told you, my love, you need to listen, okay? Evacuating means to take people out, out of a um, city that is in danger. Evacuate means to get out of something, out of the building or out of the village. And Okay, what does evacuating mean? Evacuating is a uh, um, is a uh, um, Man, you need to concentrate and stop clicking around on the computer, okay? What does evacuating mean? I told you twice now. Evacuating. Um. You are chatting with friends, I can hear that. And you're not concentrating, I told you twice what evacuating is. Man, what is evacuating? To get out of a building, our town we supposed to be in the dangerous. Okay, what happens in number two? What is depress? They are cleaning up depress. What is depress? A center by a group rapids or remains. Okay, what are they doing in number one? Uh, number one. What's number one? What's number one, man? Uh, number one is the probing food or medical uh, supplies. Okay, number three. Number three is they are cleaning up the pies. No, number three. Three is they are cleaning trappers people. But what is trap means? What does trap mean? They are, they are uh, freeing trap people. What is trap? Um, traps is a. Uh, Mm. 
What does trap mean? I didn't know. Trapped means you are stuck. You can't get out. Okay, what does trap mean? Traps is uh, you are stuck, so you can get out. What is depress? Uh, temperate. Temperate is a set that's by a surface or remains. What is um, evacuate? Um, evacuate. Is to get out of a building or tower first in the general. What is repair mean? Number five, repair. Repair. Men, what is repair? Uh, mean? Is... Repair. Men, what does repair mean? Read number five again. Repair. Um, uh, repair is a... Uh, repair is a... Um, uh, is the rework to is again one thing repair what does repair mean uh, re repair is a uh, rework to is again one thing what does repair mean uh, Repair is uh, uh, rework to it again one thing. I don't know what you are saying. Repair. Repair is a uh, rework to is one thing. You are fixing something. Yeah. You are fixing something. Repair is to fix something. They're repairing the houses and the buildings. They are fixing it. Repair. Okay, what is repair? Repair uh, is to is reverse one thing. What is repair, sweetie? Repair is reverse. A reward to is on things. To repair. Okay, setting up temporarily accommodation. What is temporarily? What does that mean? What does that mean? Temporarily. Temporary. Uh, temporary. Temporary is um. Um, I don't know. It's not permanent. It's not permanent. 
Sounds permanent. Yes, that means it's not permanent. Okay, sweetie, we're gonna stop here. You, uh, you need to concentrate more, okay? And I want you to review the projects. You did a good job, well done. I'll see you next time.